Hi, I'm Ivan Sud, I am Clipper Guy. Welcome to another video in my Healthy Hair Cutter series on behalf of Modern Salon Media's Healthy Hair Dresser Initiative. This Healthy Hair Cutter video is going to focus on another physical aspect of our health behind the chair, and that is chair height. Let's pump up the chair. Let's pump, this is an old fashioned barber chair with a hand pump. Let's pump up the chair when we're working low on the head. Bending at the waist for very long is hard on our back. Bending at the knees for very long is hard on our knees. We want to be able to stand up straight and do good work. Traditionally, barber chairs rise even higher than cause chairs do so that you can cut at eye level. You can't cut what you can't see. You want to be able to work at a height that allows you to see your work properly and also work in a comfortable position with your back straight, your shoulders square, and your hands at a reasonable height. This is going to impinge your shoulders, it's going to start to pinch and hurt your shoulders. So there's probably such a thing as having the chair too high. Then again, when we're working over the top of the head, we very well may wish to lower the chair to be able to layer or work over the top of the head at again a height that is not only visually suitable for us, but comfortable for us to work and for us to cut. The bottom line is the chair goes up and down and it goes up and down for a reason. One of the most important reasons that the chair goes up and down is to protect you and your long-term health, wellness, and durability behind the chair. I'm Ivan Zud, I'm Clipper Guy, with another Healthy Hair Cutter video on behalf of Modern Salon's Healthy Hair Dresser Initiative. Thanks for watching the video. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, get some comments started, and have a great day.